Tomorrow is Sunday, 11 June 2023 at 0900 hours Pacific Daylight Time. I will be participating in my first communications mission for 2023. I will be providing auxiliary communications for the lead communications officer, and the officer will be providing communications for our ocean training event tomorrow. The transceivers that I will be taking with me for this event is my Motorola XPR 5550 VHF transceiver, my Motorola XPR 5 five five zero UHF transceiver range four six zero to four seven zero megahertz. I will also be taking my Motorola APX eight thousand HXE, my Uniden SDS one hundred scanner, and my Garmin in reach satellite communications device. Everything fits perfectly well into my Pelican case, which also has battery power and solar power. I fashioned this setup so that I can operate my communications activities directly from the case. I don't have to unpack or pack or anything like that. I did this so that way if the commander says, we got to go, all I need to do is shut the lid down and I'm ready to go. So let's go to the paddock and I will show you the vehicle that I selected for this mission. I selected the Audi and I selected this particular vehicle out of the other vehicles that I have because it's all terrain. So in the event the commander says we have to go to the shoreline, the sandy shoreline, the beach area, or rocky mountain areas, or snow and mud, whatever, it's all terrain, this vehicle can, can handle that. I also like the fact that it has a spacious cockpit, so I can operate my communications equipment from the cockpit, but most likely I will operate my communications from the cargo area. The cargo area has its own electrical system. It's also very spacious. It provides good shade for the equipment and also gives me enough room for me to use the equipment as well as take notes and do whatever, whatever else I need to do for this particular mission. I'm really excited about working this mission tomorrow. I like working out in the ocean. I like working with communications equipment and I like providing all the support I possibly can to help the U.S. Coast Guard and the U.S. Coast Guard Auxiliary.